I now call upon my dear sister Dragana from Serbia, who owns her company, her social media network owns every second blog in Southeastern Europe. 400,000. That's the number of blog her B Premium Group owns. She says B because she works like a honey bee. And lucky me, I got a B in my name too. And she just called me Queen B. I welcome Dragana, the queen of social network and social media in Southeastern Europe. Thank you, our lovely Queen Bee. Thank you, Dr. Harbin, uh, dear ladies, uh, dear gentlemen. It's an honor to be here tonight. Um, actually, I was thinking about what to share with you uh, as a thought, as an idea, as an inspiration. Uh, for the beginning of this amazing event. I will uh, share with you uh, more details about my business and uh, how I see this social media world on uh, Wednesday, actually tomorrow at 1, uh, 15 p.m. Uh, but tonight I just wanted to share with you uh, how I understand this, our confusing business world. At the beginning of my career, uh, I thought that we actually um, don't need to keep trying to be good. Uh, don't need to be, uh, keep trying to be different, that we just have to keep trying to be good because being good is different enough. But then I was faced with a dilemma. Is being good good enough? Actually, I think it's not. Although we have to be good, we need to be committed to great and meaningful things, doing good things. So being just good, not being committed to a higher goals, meaningful work, and, and good things for us all is simply not good enough. And no, for me, business is not just about winning. It has always been about well-being, which is what the word wealth truly means. Business is not about competing with each other, especially in social media. Business is about fighting together to make a world or our little piece of it little better, more inspiring for us all. And this is who I am. Uh, that is what I share with all of you today and with all Ladies League and with all our friends all over the world who are truly successful. That is something I want to share with you during these several days, sending a message that actually you showed us how good we are and how amazingly good business world could and should be. Thank you for that. Thank you, Dr. Harbin.